Hi, welcome back to Thrifting Bean. My name is Rachel and I'm a part-time reseller. I sell on eBay, Vinted, Poshmark and the other one. Oh my gosh, my brain's been on. Anyway, so this week's been pretty wet. I haven't been out um, to any carpet sales this week and I'm busy Sunday so I probably won't be going out Saturday either, which is terrible. But I did pick up a few things from the charity shop, which I always forget to record because I'm like that. And I'll show you a few things which I have picked up and a few things which I have sold, which has been good. Last week was really great for me. This week's been a little bit slower on the eBay front. Um, I don't know whether it's because it's becoming to the end of the month where people are holding out for payday or whatever, but I don't know, I'll put a few things, that I'll, I'll run through a few things which I've sold and a few things which I have picked up. So I sold uh, this, I think it's Friday, hang on, let me look. Okay, this one was Thursday, but it was a really nice one. It's a women's uh, rockabilly t-shirt, it's like a, like a satin, not a satin, what's it, like a mesh shirt um, with a vintage face on the collar, um, lips and stuff like that, I'll put some screenshots in. Anyway, um, this is by Band Apparel, it's an extra large, it was a size, it's a size 16 but it's a vintage so it comes up a little bit smaller, probably about 14. Um, I purchased this for £3 and I sold it for £25 plus post. Let's have a look, I've got my iPad here so I'm going to see what I'm doing because I forget. Um, I sold another beat that. Uh, if you've seen before in previous videos, I picked up Beat That, which is like a family fun game, wacky fun game. Um, I accepted an offer of £13 plus postage on that. The Jules boots, I sold them previously. Um, I, I got a returns with them because the heel started to come off, so I fixed the, the heel. Actually, it was a bit of the sole, really. It was just poking out a little bit where the glue had come unstuck. I re um re glued it and i disclaimed that in the new advert and reduced the price a little bit because of that they sold uh for 18 pounds so they were at 20 list them a little bit lower and they sold like the next day this jewels raincoat which i brought from the charity shop i think it cost me about four pound and it sold for 25 it was slightly worn but jewels is always really good to sell um, the next thing which I didn't think it was going to sell for ages is the Indominus Rex um, Hybrid. So I think it's, yeah, Hybrid Rampage. I took an offer, it was listed for £79.99. Um, it's a little bit higher but I thought it's in really good condition. Some of the other ones listed were not as good condition. Um, I accepted an offer for £65.95. Um, with postage and package on top of that, sent that and it's been delivered so thank you for whoever bought that the nintendo light manuals with the stylus put out offers again i've been putting out a lot of offers lately i'm happy to drop down the price i put it on a little bit higher so i can i i've got that leeway to drop down so four pound listed at five pound and sold for four pound fifty that's out the door i think it cost me 50 pence so the wacky racers glasses which i almost broke but didn't um yeah i sold the little glass for 15 pound and i bought it for one which is great so thank you and i'm getting amazing positive feedback from everybody which is cool i sold i don't know if you saw on previous um charity shop trips i picked up a bunch of a, what, a stack of magazines and in those magazines was a lord of the rings fx uh, ff say it properly, SFX uh, magazine, I think the stat, it was like 10 for a pound, and this one was listed for five, I accepted an offer for four, oh, I actually think I put out an offer for 450, and they accepted, so I sent that out straight away, someone purchased a Concord model kit, which I picked up at the car boot sale, I think I paid, I don't know, three quid, and that sold for 15, the Hello Kitty like tote bag, I think I paid like £1.75 and that went for £8.99. Was listed for £9.99, but I'm happy to like drop down um, this little Odd Bods plush, which I picked up for 50 pence, and that's going out for £5. 
and then I just sold some vintage, uh, like a box of vintage um, decorations, mercury glass, fun, silk uh, baubles, was listed for 25, put an offer out for 22.50 and accepted. That's free postage though. But I think it's when the last one, the one before, I picked up a load of Christmas decorations. Some awesome. awesome stuff in here. £2 for the box. Yeah, that sounds good. She wanted £2 for like the two boxes. Um, happily pay that and happily pay free postage because I've made my money back already. So those are the things that I've gone out from last week to this week. I went to the charity shop and I brought this. Um, Case Logic inside it has a Sony Walkman, which is pretty cool. Like blast from the past. Love a bit of nostalgia, 90s nostalgia. It fully works. It comes with like the shock proof. I love that. Jog proof. G protection. So really nice and clean. Like battery cover. Um, clean inside, but oh, I'm gonna end up breaking it now. Put that back in there. There you go. Um but not only that, it has, if I can find it, it has like the connector so you can skip and stuff when you're on your go when you're on the go. Can you remember just like carrying one of those in your in your pocket? It was massive. But also it comes with the adapter. So you can have this in your home playing or char if you've got rechargeable batteries, I guess it will recharge it. And then you can take it out on, on the go. Put it in your rucksack. Live in the good old 90s days. Anyway, so I paid £9 for that. I have seen sold comps for about £40. Just the Walkman and like the skipper button. Not with the, um, not with the case and the charger. So I'm going to probably list it at 40 accepting offers. Um, I want it going pretty quick. It's... Hopefully it'll be a really good quick flip. I also picked up this Aria riding jacket. It was six pound. It is, I think it's a women's. It's a women's medium, which I'll say is probably like a 12, 14. But I have seen sold comps for about 50 pounds. Uh, for six pounds, it's a no brainer. It's in really good condition. Had a little bit of, um, pocket treasure in there, a couple of vapes and stuff like that, which I got rid of. But I thought that was that was good, it's in good condition. Nice little emblem on the back there, padded. Um, yeah, so if you see this brand, Ariat, it's like a riding brand, uh, pick it up, because some of them do really well. So I follow Pick Me Up Lucky on Instagram, and he recently sold, um, a load of Rachel Kane like vampire books. I saw these in the charity shop. Um, I don't know if any are original, so I will search for them. But it was numbers one to eleven for six pounds, which I thought was a pretty good deal. Um, Rachel Kane, it's the Morganville vampire books. So hopefully I should do well. If there's not original ones there, I think they sell for about fifteen twenty. I'm not going to lose a huge amount, but I think all of his were original and they sold for about 60. So once I go through these, I will let you know. I also picked up this Nets uh, woolly bobble hat for a pound. I know they br sell brand new for about 26. Hopefully I should be able to get about 10 for this. It's in good condition as well. So, And then I picked this up because how could you leave them behind? The Smiggles rucksack. Minions. I like his little braces on there. It has this cool detailing of the minions. His little legs hang below. It doesn't even look like it's been used that much. It's got this slight little mark there, which I'll get out. But has ample space. But even if it's like an overnight bag. It's really cute. And this cost me £4. I know that some of the Smiggles stuff, like that pencil cases and stuff, um, sell for quite a bit. So hopefully four into 15. And the last thing I picked up today was the Star Wars. I found it, it cost me four pounds. Um, it is, I think it's Raven, Ravensburger, whatever it's called. Ravensburger. 
Um, I don't actually think it's been used. Let me just have a quick look. So you have all the like these planets. I think you have to find a bit like um, Where's Wally. You go to a planet and you find you have to find whatever it says on the card. So it was like a fun game. So that was it. That was the things that I picked up. Um, yesterday it was really rainy, so I didn't go out. And I've been feeling under the weather, so I'm actually a little bit thankful that I've had the lay-in and the rest. Um, hopefully this week coming, I'll do a little bit more recording around the charity shop. I might be doing a private pick. I don't know if I can film there yet, but I'll let you know. And back to the car boot sales, hopefully on the Saturday, maybe Sunday. Um, the weather today has definitely dropped in temperature. I'm sure a lot of people have noticed this morning going out and doing car boots or buying at them but i just want to say thank you so much for everybody who's newly subscribed who's found me hello welcome um i appreciate you watching commenting and just staying this far um my channel is slowly growing which is absolutely amazing and i'm so thankful for everybody here joining watching listen to me blabber on so if i don't see you have a good week and be blessed